Well, hey folks, BC7 here. Welcome back to the channel. And welcome back to Farm Sim 19. Got a map review for you today. This is a map called Anaheim by Toon War. And uh, let's have a look, shall we? Boom. So, here's your general outlay. Yeah, it looks like most of the stuff is nicely centralized, except the BGA's out here. Let's go to our buy thing. I find this an easier map to use. All those colors are so confusing. So we start here. So I assume this is where they would like you to buy your farm. That's certainly a reasonable price. You get a small field, a little bit of parking space, etc., etc. Now, one thing I did find rather odd. Some of the fields, I don't think, have been quite... Excuse me, well designated properly shall we say like here is a clearly outlined meadow but if we pick it we'll see it also comes with field 42 interesting like let's just go over here if i click field 42 it also comes with the meadow hmm Inter we may have to actually check that out i also found the same thing worked was it here yeah if you buy 35, you get 52. If you buy 50, you get the little meadow. So, this may be happening in other spots as well. I'm not sure. I haven't actually gone over all of the fields. But as you can see, there's certainly um, lots to choose from. Hmm. Seems to be a phenomena that's... Uh, only a part of this lower area. Oh, 77k for the BGA. Well, that's pretty reasonable. Pretty reasonable indeed. We have live active contracts. Yep, not too many at the moment, of course, but it is just a start. Yuck. <laughs> well, there we go. There's an easy job to get you started. Excellent. All right, let's uh, have a look at what we've got for sale points. All right, nice and simple. We've got a barn for all of our hay, straw, grass products. We've got the land handle. Uh, we've got, I believe that's a dairy. Do 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 e o. Oh, yep, yep, yep. They buy milk and or eggs. All right. Oh, cotton and wool are sold at the uh, spinnery, and then of course the sawmill takes well, just logs because. Wood chips are not a thing. So there we go. Equipment, no. We're not in that mode. So, And this isn't uh, unlike a couple of the maps I reviewed. This one doesn't give you any goodies just for, you know, being such a genuinely nice fella. But what we can do and are going to do here is buy ourselves a vehicle. So, uh, I guess I don't need to be cheap, do I? 200 horse, that's not bad for a little tiny truck like that. Man, let's uh, buy up the wee lizard. Uh, uh, I hate, hate white vehicles, sorry. We gotta do something about this. Um, yeah, something more common. There we are, we're gonna buy our nice purple pickup. Yes, please. Oh, well, alrighty then. Okay. We now have a way to get around, man. So let's find this thing. There we go. Where is the shop on the map? Oops, that's not a map. That's not a map either. There we go. Okay. So, we're actually in a pretty good spot here. We can check out the barn, the animal dealer, and the spinnery. Alright, so, the uh, stock 19 shop, and that's quite all right. Let's zoom out so we can get a look at the wee bit of countryside here. Excellent. Okay. So the map seems pretty smooth so far. When I first loaded it up, I couldn't move at all, and I thought, well, uh-oh. <laughs> but as it turned out, well, it wore off. So, yeah, it, I guess it took a second for the map to cash in, but then everything worked just fine. Okay, I heard a weird moo noise. 
I think this is our animal dealer. Yep, here we go. So, a place to fetch your sheeps and cows. Awesome. Not a bad looking little set. Now, right across, we have this. Um, do you have a name? Huh. Oh, well, there you are. There's your uh, point to sell your cotton and your bale, or your uh, wool bales. I knew it was a bale of some kind. All right, very nice. So, like I said, most things seem to be fairly centralized, which is cool. That's one thing i got to say about that Felsburn map. It seems every time they want you to sell something, you've got to uh, find the opposite corner of the map and head there at all due speed. Um... Apparently, I have missed one. Um, we got the animal dealer. We got that guy. There should be something just off by the shop. Oh, sorry, man. Did not mean to be smacking into you like that, dude. Alright, can we get to it, though? Ah, I see. Alright. I think it's in here. There we go. Mm -hmm. Nope. Maybe around the back of this building? No, we're in completely the wrong direction now, aren't we? Well, goodness gracious. Wow, that's quite the ladder. <laughs> he says as he totals his truck into the railings. Come on, unhook me. So where the heck is this other sail point? Oh, I see. It's actually down further. Oh. Well. Uh-oh. Now we got somebody chasing this. <coughs> no, that's too much further. Pardon me, just doing a U-turn in the middle of the road. Why can't I get to that? No, I can't get around that other stuff, can I? See, it almost looks like it's behind here. There's got to be a better way of getting in here. Whoa. Alright. Now we're heading to the right spot. Oh, right here. Okay. There's apparently a point here. Oh, here's the barn. Okay, okay. So this is our barn. <laughs> no, he's all making sense, eh? Yes. Alright. Okay, well at least we found that. Not the easiest thing to find. I suppose, unless you drive right off the street and onto it. <laughs> well, we'll deal with that little issue later. Alright, come on, species. Get a sense of direction. If you can't have a sense of reality, at least have a sense of direction. Alright, here we go. Oh! That was so close, fella. I'm not used to you people whapping around here. Well, get up off the road and on the sidewalk, man. There's your gas station, by the way. That's why I came up here. Alright, I'm, uh, this guy's freaking me out, man. Alright, let's, let's get the heck out of Dodge here. And, uh, whoa, 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 whoa! Yes! What the heck? Man. Are you people crazy? Uh-oh, now we got vehicles. Alright, so we've got all kinds of fieldage here. Alright, let's pull over for a moment. Let's go to our map. And let's get an idea of what sort of uh, prices we've got on some of these things, shall we? So we're up here. 
So you can get these two 40, wow, really, really inexpensive, actually. How about 50? Okay, that also gives you that little meadow way the heck down there. For some obscure reason. Oh, 52, hey, there's a good deal. Check that, oh, 51 gives you 33. It's really strange. And everything is, like, so far away, <laughs> you know what I mean? 52 gives you 35, that's pretty nice. You get this huge field. Yeah, I don't know, I, I, I have a feeling maybe this isn't quite... Okay, oh, 46 and 45. See, and you also get 21. That's just weird. Um, I'm just gonna buy. Yeah. Yep, they're all marked as ours. Isn't that strange? Isn't that strange? Ha! Huh. Well, there you go. You learn something weird every day. Okay. I'm going to have to jump in here with all of these trees. We really can't see anything that's going on. The map almost seems unnaturally bright. Maybe it's just a particular time of day. Now, what do we got going on here? Another large... Uh, large stopping spot here for placing things. Oh, I see. Okay. <coughs> and... Can you... Oh, yeah. Oh, and it also... See, again. Weird, eh? For 243, you can buy this, which comes with a fair bit of grassland. And it also gives you 36, which is a rather huge field. Huh. About stuff like this is just... Hmm. Isn't that strange? Alright, so I guess that would be another place you could start your farm. Um, that's kind of cool. Kind of cool. What an odd shape, eh? It's almost like, uh... Oh, maybe if you start in the, uh, the other one. The other mode, where you've got a farm and some kit and stuff like that. Maybe you'll get, uh get a bit of uh, a start there instead. Like there may be sheds and all kinds of things there. That might be why it's such an odd shape. I like how all the info shows up on the rear view mirror of the truck just like it was, you know, one of them smart mirrors. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I got news for you. Mirrors are smarter than most of the kids in school these days. I'm just kidding. Love you all. All right, what do we got here? Okay, this is the mule. Huh. Okie donkey. Alright, and they buy pretty much everything. Okay. A green stop right back here. And tip, fill wallet appropriately, and drive away. Lovely. Okay. Oh, there was a way out. That's alright. That's alright. We'll use this one. And continue on our trip. There's a lot of fields on this map. And I noticed them... I think this is the first one I've seen where there's quite a lot of smaller fields, too. You could almost, uh, you know, get into a bit smaller kit. As I see, some of it is becoming available slowly but surely through the mod sites. I noticed a couple of smaller Ursus tractors, and uh, I think there's a... I saw a far... Um, what you would call it? Combine? Fairly small one. You know, open cab type of... Well, no cab. <laughs> might be a little closer to the truth. Alright, I think we can come back out here and have a little look-see. I'm just on the way down to the Baga, so... <laughs> oh! Little doggy barking off in the distance. That's always cool. Um, yeah. 
I think we'll go down to the next intersection. Should be the easiest way. There's some big trees here, man. <laughs> really big trees. Alright, we should be coming up on it here. There we go. I missed it. Yeah. And again, we're going to have to jump inside in some of these spots because these trees are just too huge, man. Anyway, and there's space so that you have no choice <laughs> as soon as one clears the next one's right in your face so let's just jump back in here alrighty then and here we have the Baga or BGA I suppose if you need to like break it all down Alright, and we've either missed the entrance, or no, it's not going to be on the other side, because there is no other side. So we've just missed the entrance, that's cool. It will drive around the tree there, boy. There we go. Dee 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 dee. I would actually thought this was going to go right by it, but apparently... This is the innie and the outie. That's probably the innie over there, but that's okay. Wow. We're uh, setting up for some big space in here, eh? Holy smokes. Look at the size of me, man. Ah, oh, yeah. Lots of room to tip and turn around. And there you go, all that happy stuff. That's the way I like them. Much nicer than having to wander around the other side. Alright. I guess they don't have scales implemented yet in uh, 19. Because I don't think even the uh, stock in-game maps have uh, a way to deal with that yet. Alright, let's head a little further down the road. This is not quite, uh, I'm just noticing here on the map, we're actually out by a fair bit. Um, well, this is kind of odd. Huh. This is kind of odd indeed. Hmm. Well, I think what I'm going to do, uh, for the sake of practicality here, Snick between these two fields. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Just to save us going all the way around the outside. Up, 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 up. Let's go. There we are. We're back to the road. Now yeah, we're just going to follow this fella because that won't make him too freaked. Doo -doo 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 -doo. All right. And we'll follow him at the standard distance. I think we're making them nervous. And cuts to the inside for the pass. <laughs> Alright, so down here we have our dairy and our land handle. Or shop, store, whatever the heck that stands for. Man, they really don't give you much notice that's coming, I'll tell you. Alright, so, here we go. Our point of tippage. Boop, 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 boop. And tip, tip, tip. Money, money, money. Yay. Yeah, nice little pile of garbage. Perfect. For the cheap amount of money you guys pay out, you should be able to pick up your garbage. And this, one can only assume. Let's get a bit of a map up here. All right, looks like they want us to come in over here. This is the dairy. Cool gas. Hmm, okay. 
apparently one of the things that Aerie produces is gas. <laughs> you know, not that cows aren't known for their gas production, but that's okay. Alrighty, so that's that. Um, what else have we got here? Ooh, the sawmill, eh? Alrighty, let's go check the sawmill. Coming out. Ooh, I did cut somebody off. <laughs> oh, lordy, lordy. Oh, come on, fella. Do-do-do-do. Nah. There we go. We're back on Sawmill Road. Oh, this is a weird one. Whoa. Okay, less time looking at the map, more time looking out the windshield, fella. Jeez, thank God I don't drive like that in real life. I really don't. I, I do pay attention. <laughs> and I don't use maps. but Or GPS. I've never actually used a, a vehicle GPS. I swear. I've never had a vehicle that talked to me. Or a device in a vehicle that talked to me. Well, except a radio, but, you know. Yeah, it's... None of the roads actually line up with the map. See, once again, now I, we're not as far out, but as you can see, we're making a smaller loop than the road actually shows. Hmm. And now we're on the outside of it. Okay. All right, look, look, look. We're coming up on the sawmill. Here we go. I love how you can do that. <laughs> And here we are, the mill of saws. Yes, indeed. Say what? Sell wood. Chung chung. There we go. We've sold wood. All right. Can I sell some of this? Oh, that's nice. You don't end up inside it. That used to always creep me out. You know, there'd be hay bales or a stack of logs, and you'd go to climb on it, and you'd just sort of, yeah. Um. This is generally the sort of setup we'd find coming in off the uh, log pond, but <laughs> got news for you guys, you forgot to put the pond in. Alright, well, it's a nice little facility. Am I hopelessly stuck back here now? Oh, no, not so old. Oh, this is quite the... Oh, come on. I want to get in there. Yes, there we go. Ah, the sound of saw blades working. Perfect. Mm, a couple of picnic tables. We'd be having a nice time over here. Beautiful sunny day. Wowzer. <laughs> Speaking of beautiful sunny days, I guess this would be uh, Boxing Day that this map goes up. So I do hope you all had yourselves an excellent, excellent Christmas. And uh, I don't know how mine went because it's actually uh, Christmas Eve right now. So, <laughs> we'll have to see. As I said, my only plans for the day are to actually go and spend some time with my buddy Mike in the hospital. So, beyond that, not much. Ah, here we have another kind of padded area. Let's have a look at our map. Oh yeah, okay. And if we go to the by me now, that's a decent sized field, eh? Uh, well, at least for a change, that's all it gives you. But yeah, I guess this would be another spot for locating a farm. Very interesting. Very interesting. And again, more than reasonably priced. So, hmm. Not bad. Not bad at all. Lots of grass on this one too, eh? Then there's a house here, but I don't think think. Oh, this is the one we started at, isn't it? <laughs> is this why this all looks so familiar? Yeah, it is. Okay. Well, I guess, since this is where we start. And no, this isn't a uh, sleep here now type of house, unfortunately. Um, as we've seen on a couple of the maps, like I said, where even in this mode, there is a few things laying around. No, this is the true starter mode, so... There you go. Yes, a character. Well, then which field is ours? I'm pretty sure we own something, don't we? If we buy this? 
Do we not own little piece of property? Or just grass, I guess. Yeah, I think we just own grass. Everything else here is going to be somebody else's stuff. There's a fair bit of it. It's not plowed grass, so you won't get any kind of a great yield. Yeah, and Sophie Dresder. A lot of uh, female farm owners in this area. Interesting. But there you go, guys. Um, there will be a link to the map in the description down below. Again, it is called Anaheim. And, oh, maybe this is our field? Oh, we never bought this area yet. So that, oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Thinking, boy, that's all they give us is a house we can't sleep in? What a ripoff. But, yeah. So, anyway, as I was saying, the map is called Anaheim. It was uh, built by two more, and there will be a link in the description down below. Hope everybody enjoyed. If you did, please remember to hit that like button on your way out. You know, make it like a New Year's resolution to always hit the like button. How's that? Good deal? <laughs> All right, with that, take care of each other, folks. Ciao for now.